Hummer 6.2 sputtering system made by Anatec Limited. Uh, this system can do DC plating and DC etching and also plasma uh, switch mode plating. Uh, the system consists of a built-in vacuum pump and there's a vacuum gauge to indicate the vacuum level and there's a current discharge current plasma current meter and the system has a timer and voltage control section with voltage regulator and switching on. But the system has a built-in gas valve to turn on the uh, gas. I hooked it up with the argon gas. And this system is basically used for coding scanning electron microscope samples uh, mounted on a sample holder like this. Uh, you can use silver paste or double sided conductive tape. And this sample holder, uh, several sample holders can be placed on the sample holder. Uh, I have here about four of them. Uh, we can put as many as we need. And once the samples are installed, uh, make sure that the bell jar is uh, pre-installed with the gaskets. And place the bell jar approximately concentric to the base plate. And I have an aluminum ring here installed uh, which will assist in edge mode. At this moment I don't have a target, but usually an annular ring with the material pre-deposited or available from the any uh, scanning electron microscope accessory suppliers. There are different dimensions available. We have to find the right one with the right dimensions. The ID, the inner diameter and outer diameter should match this ring. And to start the unit, close the chamber door and turn on the power. As soon as we turn on the power, the, the pumps, pump down begins. So make sure the gas valve is off. Once the pumping starts, the indication is from 200 millitor down to 20 millitor. It takes about a couple of minutes before the, the chamber vacuum level reaches to about 20 millitor. We have a Detailed user manual uh, to assist the operator. So, once the vacuum level reaches reaches below 20 millitor or at 20 millitor, turn on the gas valve using the toggle switch. and adjust the needle well to the required pressure. The inlet gas pressure is about 15 PSI. I'm using organ gas. To manually turn on the plug, DC H mode, turn on the manual mode, make sure the regulator is zero, turn on the power, and adjust the voltage control, keeping eye on the current, the discharge current.
to run in auto mode, set the timer and turn on the timer switch to auto mode and when the time, the set time is over, the high voltage to the electrodes will be turned off. Timer is up. Now I turn off the voltage. Uh, before switching it, switching the mode control switch to plate mode. It's always recommended to turn off the voltage controller. And then so turn on the power again for DC plating. In case uh, we don't want to do DC plating for extended period of time, uh, which may result in the sample heating up, then uh, the operation mode should be selected for the uh, pulse mode, during which the plasma will be turned on for a certain time and turned off. Uh, I'm going to demonstrate that. I'm going to select the time of about two minutes and turn on the power. Turn the pulse mode on. Now the power is switched off after a few seconds. Power will turn on again. At the end of the process, turn off the power and the gas 
switches and reduce the voltage control knob and to vent the chamber turn off the whole power to the machine and it will take a couple of minutes the vent valve will open and the chamber will be ready to switch the sample Removing the the annular ring, electro target material. This is our in-house sample here. Uh, I'm using two flat blade screwdrivers. So these are the three openings where the pins are inserted in. The target is, the outer diameter is 75 millimeters, which is approximately 3 inches. And the inner diameter is 50 millimeters, that is 2 inches. They are available from Ted Bella or Anatech Limited as well.